you need to find a place that's your own. And me finding a place of my own has saved my life. And it has allowed me to have the best manifestations that I have ever had, where I have met people like Saletta Blue. I have met Mr. Morrison's wife, Ernestine Morrison. I have met Les Brown, the guy who I literally listen to every day, didn't really know his name. That's crazy, you know, right? I listen to all these motivational speakers and this man walks into Salita Blue's book signing with Ray, book signer, author. Uh, she was the person who put this all together and her and Saletta teamed up and made a fabulous book signing where Les Brown showed up too. <laughs> and I was shocked because I'm looking at this man and I'm like, I know this guy. And everybody's like, that's somebody. And I'm like, who? And it was like, you know, such and such. And I'm like, I don't know that name. That kind of sounds familiar. And I'm like, but no, I know this guy. Like, why do I know this guy? And it is the man, Les Brown, who I wake up to listening to every morning with several other motivational speakers, Lisa, uh, Gary, who else is there? I got the, the Will Smith. Uh, gosh, there's so many of them. Uh, I can't even begin to Tony. <laughs> and to see him standing there and talking to him, it let me know that even though back in the day, during this time of year, I was a wreck, sometimes even hospitalized, people can change. And I was able to be at this beautiful event for these lovely authors, female authors who are out here doing the damn thing. And I actually got to meet somebody who helps me be the best me that I can be. And I had a feeling inside of me like a little kid and it felt so great because I was so giddy. And I was like, oh my God, I've never felt like this about somebody like, I guess, you know, like I, I get to meet them. I've met a lot of celebrities. I've, I've, I've dated them, I've been around, but I've never felt like this, the way that I felt when I met Les Brown. And it was so great that we got to talk. I mean, he's even talking about working with me. So this manifestation thing is real. And I just wanted to share this all with you because if, you don't take the time to clean the clutter. If you don't take time to take audit of yourself, if you don't take time to stop ritual, generational, you know, programmed activities, doing tasks, lifestyle choices, and, and move that stuff out your way, sweep that in the trash and start, you know, your new self, your new phase of your life. You won't get to experience these manifestations. You'll always experience the doubt and the lower frequency feeling of depression. And we all go through it to some point or another, but some of us can stay in it and never get out. But I'm telling you, you can, because if I did it, you can do it. And if I can meet the person who most motivates me and has literally taught me things that I wish my own father could have taught me and to meet this person, and I didn't even know they were coming. I, I mean, it, it wasn't even my event. It's crazy because Ray has a book, Move, Move or Die. Saletta has a book, Get Over Him in an Hour. And here are these two beautiful women, powerful women, and Les is sitting here, Les Brown, Mr. Les Brown is, is literally congratulating him and, and doing what we all didn't even know we manifested. And he knew like, this is, you guys are great. This is a great environment. His wisdom was there. The energy was there. It was, it was amazing. Like, it was amazing. So I do, I do have some clips. I have some things that I'm gonna share with everybody. I'm gonna make sure that you guys see the event. I broke everything down. Share this experience with me, guys, where you see that manifestations are real. I didn't do anything. I didn't know where this manifestation was coming from. I was just honored to be at a friend's event. Support her and another author who put themselves out there to be them best, their best selves despite it all. And so I just felt honored to be around that beautiful energy. And thank you, Salita, so much for inviting me. Thank you, Ray, for having me there. And happy birthday to you. It was a beautiful event, you two. It was, it was amazing. Uh, thank you, Les Brown, for talking to me and taking pictures with me <laughs> and indulging me. It was so great because I've never had somebody say, hey, you want to take a picture with me? I mean, you are amazing. Thank you so much. I was honored. It was, it's just a blessing to get to know you. And I do hope to be doing more with you it's just amazing so get that clutter out the way everybody so that you can manifest your best life and it's not going to come like you think it's not going to come all wrapped up and perfect you got to take time to get there it's going to come in small bits you're going to get moments of success earn it and learn to be thankful i am so 
thankful for everything that I have been given in 2020. You guys can have mental balance. I can have mental balance. We can do this together. I love you guys. Thank you for this mental wellness segment. I'll be at you soon. Because of you. And I want to personally thank you for awakening the gift that was in me. And if I had not met you, I would have never been able to have children all over the year. And around the world, y'all. Come on, put your hands together. Well, this is the new year. This is the new year. And I want Me? 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 always helping people, has a healing spirit about her, and I was so proud of the book that she has produced. She has so many talents. Remember the, the Four Tops had a song years ago called Still Water Runs Deep? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Millennials don't know anything about that. <laughs> that was years ago. Mm -hmm. and, and she she's that kind of person. She has depth yes. and very intelligent very versatile, and she is a person that builds powerful, loyal relationships. Yes, that's what, Yes. that's how we got ours. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So there's no way I was not going to be here today, but most importantly, it's good to have positive relationships that can take you to a place within yourself that you can never go by yourself. And one of the things I love about Ray is that she's determined to live a life that will outlive her. And she makes her own contribution to people in her own special way. And meeting her father, it has been just a joy to meet him, who is a very talented person teaching young kids how to play the piano, and just met her mother, but also having a chance to meet people in her network. You know, your network determines your net worth. That's right. And so she's got a lot of quality people here. And I tell you, at this stage of my life, at 75, I'm so glad to be here. What? Let's get out of here. Well, thank you so much. You know black gold man. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Stop it. It's a Vaseline. always to to be able to come out and celebrate someone's work with our be interviewing her on our Facebook Live where we have over a million people. I've just moved here around seven or eight months ago oh, wow. from Cleveland, Ohio. It was so cold in Cleveland I saw Superman ride in a cab. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Uh, I have a granddaughter and a great grandson and a sister living in Atlanta. I'm coming down here. And so it's been a pleasure of being here and, and being associated with Cancer Centers of America because of God's grace and mercy. I'm a 27 year cancer conqueror. Yes, yes. yes. amen. And so 2020, clear vision. Let me leave this with you. As you think about your goals and dreams, as you begin to focus into the future, commit yourself to be willing to do the things today others won't do in order to have the things tomorrow others won't have. Mm -hmm. It's a brand new day. And literally, the economic rug has been snatched out from millions of people. And the people that are going to be able to be in control of their destiny will have to have a, a sense of discipline. Socrates said, the undisciplined life is an insane life. And deep mental resolve and create
this is where you come in, collaborative, achievement-driven, supportive relationships. You have those things going for you, the possibilities are unlimited of what you can create. You have something special. You have greatness in you. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. Put your hands together for the Godfather. The Godfather. All right. Come on, turn it up, turn it up. Thank you. 